All right, so you guys may have noticed something. Today, I'm not out with Tiffany at all. In fact, she's back at the house and I'm working. Ta-da. We're at Claremont Day. Well, anyway, today I'm at an event called Pig on the Pond over in Claremont by Champions Lake. It's a really cool event over in Claremont held once a year where all the vendors come out and they show off all the really cool stuff that they have. Hyundai is here, we're here, everybody is. Napleton. But anyway, we're gonna go ahead and walk around and then we're gonna show off some stuff, all right? Like for instance, let's start with checking out that awesome boat. Wow, <laughs> check this out. Super aeronautic boat. Beautiful color, $125,000 for this boat. That is amazing. That's okay, you don't like it? All right. <laughs> now here we are over at the Ford booth. Here we have our brand new Ranger. The only downside right now is it's covered in pollen, but this thing is an awesome XLT. You lose some of the cool stuff like the leather, but you get a nicer entry price, but you still get that nice touch screen in the middle the lane keeping assist, adaptive cruise, still get a lot of great stuff and it's a four wheel drive. So when it comes to food, there is real no shortage of good food when it comes to these fair events. That's what I learned. Before this, me, I was not a barbecue fan. You guys know I'm not really big on eating outdoors ever. But yesterday, they had me try this barbecue sundae. They had beans, coleslaw, and barbecue pork in it. But what surprised me is it actually worked. And that was really weird. More weird to people than what I'm doing right now. Because you guys know I'm always at Disney doing this, so I'm used to it. Like over here, they got sweet and savory grilled corn cake with fresh mozzarella cheese. They also do barbecue tacos, empanadas. And then of course you got the Kona Ice vehicle. Kona Ice, if you remember, they used to actually go around to UCP. Now this one is actually right in our backyard. Uncle Kenny's Barbecue. It's actually over by Citrus Tower. And from what all my customers tell me, this place actually has good barbecue. We'll have to check that out. Now, in case you're wondering, it's a little weird doing this without Tiffany next to me. Because normally, she'd be right beside me, guiding me, telling me about things. So it's a little different, isn't it? <sighs> but what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and get something to try to eat. And I think I know what we're gonna do. It's a little outside the norm from what we're used to. Okay, so we just got the pork roll and it looks pretty darn good. 
So let's go ahead and let's take a look at that. After that, I'm gonna go ahead and try to find a drink. Cause I think the Boy Scouts are still selling their lemonade and their sweet tea. And that was pretty darn good yesterday. So this is the pork egg roll. It looks pretty good. And honestly, it looks pretty good. Let's try. Now Alex, Alex is going to show you guys one of his freestyles that you have to get the you know what? That is really good. I'm really impressed with it. And for that there, it was $9, but it wasn't too bad. Because essentially, all the money that's collected from my sale, and from everybody's sale today, is going to benefit kids' scholarship funds from what I've been told. And I think that's a really good program to help with. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and take a break. I'm gonna eat my food. And when I come back, we're gonna go ahead and walk around. Maybe we'll check in with some other places, all right? Now that is pretty cool. That, Tiffany would not do. I don't think I could either. All right, so I just got my lemonade. Six dollars. And fortunately, Tiff, they didn't accept the pig bucks here. So I had to use my regular money, but whatever. So I'm still in the search for that cool snack. And honestly, I don't know what the heck to do. Because I want something that's good and something that's not out of the normal. But it's awfully hard to find that. So, I'm trying to figure out, do I want cheese fries now? Cheese fries, you can get almost anywhere. Or, maybe I will just do that deep fried Oreo. Tiffany will kill me, but hey, at least it'll be a nice step and worth it. Much like the lemonade. Tiffany, I love you, sweet girl, but you're not here with me, so you know what that means. I'm just going to say screw it and try something that I haven't had before. Let's go get it. So here we are. Fried Snickers, fried Oreos, funnel cake, and Taff. You know what we're gonna do. It's the fried Oreos. Or is it the fried sneakers? I don't know. Let's see. Okay, so before I show you what I got, quick little ando. We were given these things called pig butts. And essentially what it is, it's money that you can use for food and drinks at participating vendors. And what was funny is that I had some leftover because I had to use my debit card for some food because they didn't accept it or it was just going to run over and it would have been like $3 on the debit card. And that would have been unfair of a processing fee to some of these places. So what I did was I tried to give it to a couple of people that were walking by. Just giving them free money basically and they said no it was weird it's kind of like people don't want to take something that's out of a kindness I just don't get it sometimes with people so now I'm going to show you what I got I went ahead and I did the deep fried Snickers Seems really weird to me. Wow. I would have never thought that fair food could actually be so much fun. 
Okay guys, so I have to admit though, that Snickers bar, it was really creamy. It was really sweet and nice. The powdered sugar, I look like a mess now, but it was pretty darn good. I got my lemonade, I got everything. I got Johnny Mac in front of me, look at that. I even had a fried Snickers. No way. Yes. Uh, was it good? Yeah, it was actually good. <laughs> Where'd you get this lemonade thing from? All the way down there. I have to go find me something, I need something. You have fun, man. Thank you. So, when it comes to this stuff here, small little traditions like pig on the pond are really cool. I gotta give it credit. And honestly, I didn't think it was gonna be fun. When I originally was signed up for this, I thought, man, this is gonna suck. It's gonna be two days of me sweating my butt off in the sun. But instead, I turned it into something better. The first day I was here, I scooped it out with Craig. And then the second day, I thought, you know what, let's have some fun. Ooh, tiny homes-ish. Let's check these out real quick. Now, while this might be a little small for me and Tiff to live in, Oh yeah, that's too small. We need something bigger. <laughs> Let's go take a look at this over here. The Coachman Miranda. Miranda. This looks pretty awesome. Oh, these people here are actually with that show. Oh, they are? Oh, I didn't know they were staged actors. Oh, yeah. Well, this one here literally has one of our work shirts on. This guy works here. Okay. The holder, that guy might work here someday. He might work here. How you doing? Chris Bell. Nah, nah, nah. He's going to be a motocross racer. Yeah, there you go. He's going to be a baseball pitcher. Oh, look at He's that. He's going to be a little one. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, this one here is six ten. Yes. Two hundred ninety dollars a night. Great for an excursion, a three nighter. You can take your family and some of your friends, softball players, maybe some cheerleaders or dancers. Uh, you can take them out for a little excursion. Get a hundred miles a day and six hours of generator time for every night you rent. If you go over your mileage, it's only 32 cents a mile. So if you do 100 miles, 32 bucks. Do 1,000, 320. What you don't use, you get the money back. All right. $1,000 deductible to take it out on a deposit. Bring it back the same way you got it. It goes right back. All right. Awesome. Thank you. No, thank you. Got a camera. Let's take a whole thing. Let's see. Leave. Check this out. Larry, for Lily's toys. So this is the master bedroom. Yeah, TV right there. Bed is right here. Really cool. And bathroom is right there. A little privacy door. But I'll do the side if you don't see what's in that bathroom. You got a little baby bathroom. You got a little toilet. Oh, I look like a mess right now. I know I do. But, look at the Cedar Creek. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Good. How much is one of these? This one here is 80. 85. 85? Not bad. Wow. This is gorgeous. I can see me chilling out here with Tiff. Lay back, watch the TV. Lily over there chilling. But what's cool is coming up here. First of all, this bathroom is pretty nice. Look at this bedroom. It's big enough just for us. 
gets a little small in the shower. But at least you have a privacy door for when you're going potty. That's cool. Yeah. Now something like this would actually be towed with like an F-250 of what we brought out actually. Okay guys, so now we are truly done. I am tired now. Ah, working the event the past couple days, dealing with everything. It's been a lot of fun, but it's time to say goodbye for now. I remember we are going to be over at Animal Kingdom in about I want to say Friday? Yeah. What we're going to be doing is Friday is going to be an interesting day. During the daytime with Friday, we're going to go out and we're going to see one of the parks, me and Tiffany. And then at nighttime, we're going to go back out again and we're going to go over to Animal Kingdom for nighttime viewing. Because I've been wanting to see what it looks like at nighttime in Pandora especially. Okay? So I need you guys to go ahead and click the like button. You know the whole deal. Subscribe for me. Do everything. All right? I know. So thanks for watching this video. I really appreciate having you guys. And I hope you guys like the new camera quality. All right? I'll talk to you later. Bye for now.